Hello everyone, this is your man Hype Man. Welcome back to my channel. This time we'll be doing a review on a WWE Elite Collection wrestling figure that I did pick up from Big Lots for ten dollars. Series sixty five, and it says it's the true. Let me show you that what it says. The true FX. That means they probably do a, a they do a facial scan of the person that they want to do a figure of. And if you notice on the side, it does says. We have on the side of the box. Here's the other figures you can collect in the line right there. I see all these. I don't know why I didn't buy them. Oh, I know why I didn't buy them because um, <clears throat> this all all these came out one big them big brown boxes. Now listen to me, guys. Came all these came out the big brown boxes. When they all came out the big brown boxes, the big brown box that says Mattel on the front. <clears throat> now I work for Big Lots for like. Three weeks, and I'll tell you the reason why I quit the big lots in another in, in another video. <clears throat> and I noticed all these was in there, and when I saw all these in there, now Rusev was ten dollars, Normal Reigns was at fifteen dollars, um, Eric Young was at ten dollars, um, I can't think of his name right now. He was at ten dollars, she was at ten dollars, and she was at fifteen. So I said, you know "What? I didn't really feel like dealing with it. I just gonna get the figure I wanted." And I just left. Didn't understand why they did that. I mean, I could have discretion and say, hey, well, y'all got different prices on there. But I, I was left. It was the holiday season. I bought it. So I just left. There's a picture of Rusev right there. Right there, as you can see. And there's a picture of how he looks also on the side. So, be truthful, you guys. This is my third time doing the video. <clears throat> and every time I mess it up, trying to upload it. So I hope I'll get a chance to upload it that quickly. And we're going to show, show you off the accessories. There's the hands, left and right. There's the other hand, and these hands are on the hinge. And there's a key. Now, if you're into wrestling, he did one time came down with, I think, a key at WrestleMania like a year or two ago. I can't remember. Now, it did say something on the, the back of it. And now, I'm trying to get it to focus so you can see that. Let's see something. Let me move it away. Trying to get the focus so you can see that while I'll, I'll be running out of video. I'll take a picture of it and I'll put it on Instagram. Oh, guys, start following me more on Instagram. I'll put it in the description below to follow me more on Instagram. <clears throat> a couple of people I went to their pages and I wanted to leave comments and I couldn't leave comments because the comments was cut off. So if you see where I didn't leave no comments, that's the reason why. <clears throat> and um, if you can't leave a comment on my page, I, I understand. I get it because I seen some of the comments on some people's pages was cut off, so, so that's why I didn't leave any. So here's my Rusev action figure. Now I did put them on the necker stand. Now people who saw the review on my necker, uh, um, uh, about the necker stands, what figures it can fit on. That's what that's from. So that's did come clear stand. So good chance you can check out that review. Here's his face scanning right there. And the back of it. Also right there. This shirt is a cloth material with the Velcro in the middle. Um, you can, it fits him kind of snugly. I wish it was just a little tad more bigger. But it doesn't repeat in, in, in articulation at all if you want to. So you can still get good articulation in the, in, in the shirt. You also notice that says Happy Rusev Day. It was a he starts still do it sometimes now where the crowd just goes to Rusev Day, Rusev Day. As you have to watch the rest and understand. There's a detail also in his boots. All right, there. Now, I did hit these ankles up. Now, remember the last review I said about the ankles? So, you know, to heat up the ankles, you make sure you put them in hot water. Now, I did heat them up. They should move. Move very smooth. It's a little rough on the movement, but it moves pretty well. You do have... Calf rotation, um, knee rotation. Now these knee pads right here are going to hinder him going getting that the thigh as all the way up, but you can get it. But the knee pads just going to hinder a little bit. You get upper thigh rotation. Now this also his waist right here was um, stuck a little bit, so I had to put that in hot water. So you do get um, wrist um, wrist. 
uh, waist rotation. Couldn't get it out. You do have an air crunch that can go forward and back, and you can get the arms to go out on the sides, and you get about 90 degrees on the elbow. Nice move in the, in the, um, in the hands. The head, yeah, it, goes, it goes up about really nothing, and it goes back. So that's about it on that. And oh, you do have the um, the splits. You can get them split, and you can get the leg to go back about that far, and about forward that far. Good, nice possibility. Good articulation for the price range. Normally, this figure runs about <clears throat> about between twenty to twenty twenty five in regular retail stores like Walmart and Target. But you do find them in um. So 